And welcome back. Today there is a Fire TV Stick HD Light Max Gen 3.5 720p Fire Stick update. <laughs> I don't even know what to call this thing. Um, going to show you guys exactly what it is, what you get. Uh, I did see it pop up and I'm just like, what is this? What is the update? Um, and people are saying like, hey, I don't even see where the update is. So this one's going to walk you through it so that way you know exactly what you're getting. If you guys are brand new to the channel, consider subscribing. And if you're a returning subscriber, welcome back. Try to get you guys here all the latest and greatest stuff and try to hook you guys up with something that actually works. Personally, I like the Fire Stick Max. Would I get the Fire TV Stick HD? No. Okay. So <laughs> let's come here to the device. And people have been asking, how do you get this update thing? Or do I even need it? Or is it even available? So go to your settings, go to My Fire TV. You want to click on About. And then right here it says Install Update. It says an update is available. The update will automatically begin, blah, 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 blah. I don't even care. Install Update now. The only thing about this thing is it doesn't tell you what these updates are are when you click on them so it could be i know there's some updates with you can now search for movies which in a much simpler way portion of it they made it a lot better the remote they made it a little bit more responsive with a couple things um whatever it is it says this may take a few minutes do not press any buttons on the fire tv remote so that means put it down stop playing with it and let it do its thing Okay, so it looks like the update's done. That, that was a weird update. Oh, no, it's not done. Oh, the screensaver just came up out of nowhere, and I had to push the back button, even though it says don't push any buttons. Yeah, I don't know why they would do that if, uh, if it's doing an update. Okay, so looks like we're done. Looks like the update is now finished. I did see a couple pop-ups that said this is ready for this. That's ready for this. Um, looks like there is another update available after clicking it so yeah all you got to do is just click on it and just hopefully it doesn't take another 20 30 minutes like the last update did okay so it looks like that's pretty much it looks like the device is now updated um yeah the one thing i do wish is that it did tell you what it was updating it to like what was the different stuff i do notice after this update it feels like it's a little bit snappier um and just a little bit easier to use so pretty good not too bad um yeah let me know what you guys think i try to get you guys here some of the basic stuff on what to do um it looks like the remote did have some updates and there's going to be some other updates that this thing is doing so just so that way the usage of this thing is going to be easier for you so let me know what you guys think hopefully this video has helped you out that way you guys know exactly how to find those updates and yeah you guys take care take care of each other see you guys in the next one